YouTube guys, my name is Zaheer. So in this video, I am going to do a camera review of this Realme One, and I am shooting this video with the front camera of this Realme One. So let me know how to do it and how to do it. So first of all, guys. Let me tell you that it has the 13 megapixel rear camera with the f2.2 aperture. So let's take a look at some samples. So guys, as you see here, these pictures are taken in the bright daylight situation. And as you see over here, the color saturation dynamic range is quite good over here. I have to say in the daylight situation, it works quite well. As you can see over here, you can take some amazing quality pictures in the daylighting situation. The dynamic range is not that great so to tackle that issue you can enable the HDR mode. It helps a lot when you turn on the HDR mode. It brings out the detail from the shadows so yeah. Moving to the portrait mode guys even though it has only single camera but it can take some portrait pictures but it's not quite good as you see over here there is lots of blemishes. It's not very good I would say but for the price of 9000 rupees it's quite okay I would say. But now moving to the indoor lighting situation guys here I have to say I am super impressed with this phone because this phone cost only 9000 rupees and it works really well especially the camera in the indoor lighting situation it performs really good as you see here there is not noticeable amount of noise present over here as you see it it works pretty well and the photos comes out to be really good as you see over here these pictures are taken in the very low lighting situation and as you see here the amount of noise is very very less as you see and the low lighting images are very good and in extreme low lighting as you know already that it has only f2.2 aperture so it is not going to be performed really good as you see now moving to the video guys it can shoot 1080p videos in 30 fps as you can see this is a 1080p 30 fps sample and i can say it's not very good i would say it's kind of average or below average i would say that it has a lot of artifacts in the videos i don't know why and i don't think that it has eis so yeah now guys moving to the front facing camera it has 8 megapixel front facing camera with the same f2.2 aperture and you can take some good selfies with the front facing camera in the good day lighting situation as you see over here yeah it has the ai beauty vision mode which over the works and it has the front facing portrait mode too which works quite well for the pricing and i mean it has a lot of blemishes in the certain area especially at the hair but for 9000 rupees it works quite well as you see over here and now moving to the indoor lighting situation and guys it works very well and you can take some great selfies with the front facing camera with this smartphone as you see over here it works really good it has the ai beauty vision mode which smoothens your skin like in a whole different level and i don't like it and when it comes to low lighting you have the display fill light flash type of thing so you can you can take some photos by illuminating the display basically and you can also have the 1080p 30 fps video recording on the front facing camera too so you can basically record uh, videos from the front facing camera too and the video quality from the front facing camera is quite good as you see over here the dynamic range is definitely not going to be great but it's quite okay i would say for the price of rupees 9000 in my conclusion guys i have to say the camera on this smartphone is quite good you can take some amazing pictures in the good lighting situation and when it comes to low lighting situation it it struggles a little bit but it can take some really good pictures and even you can take some amazing selfies with the front facing camera of this smartphone and when it comes to video the video recording capability of this smartphone is not that good so yeah so if you want to purchase this smartphone i will leave a link in the description box below from where you can purchase it guys yeah that's all in this video guys i hope you do like this video if you did then don't forget to hit that like button i have already posted a charging test and a lot more other videos on this phone i will leave a link in the description box below from where you can watch that so yeah that's all in this video guys thank you so much for watching this video bye bye